just so R- just so we can get done faster or done quicker, I guess. Is... Bro, RP this case, bro. Rest in pussy, bro. <laughs> Shut up, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Rad. Right. Is this what Godot was talking about? Yeah. These trick locks. Now then, Iris, if you could please remove these. Um, Mr. Edgeworth, I I'm afraid I can't. It it's not possible for me. What? Not possible. During the earthquake, when the cabin was in danger of caving in, Iris escaped. And I know that there was only one lock when I came here last time. So they're saying that you can't undo the new locks? Yes. Only I was strong enough. Which you would never be! Fucking Edgeworth. Edward, <laughs> how are you feeling? You look a little pale. Huh. You'll want to talk, right? With your face all green. Miles, go and get some air. I'll watch over the suspect and your boyfriend. You go and get a grip on yourself. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. I'm perfectly fine. What? <laughs> <laughs> There's no telling what sort of mistakes you could make in your current state. Go and get some rest. That's your only concern now, Miles Edgeworth. You useless piece of shit. <laughs> Damn. I guess I will. This time, you hobby. I'll handle the investigation in the garden. You two take care of things here. Man, that guy looks shaking up. He has too much pride. He's probably crying right now. Pride is simply another trap that hinders us in our lives. That said, one must have pride to be effective on the job. At any rate, it seems that this is where we part ways, Phoenix. I'm going to stay here and see if I can't help solve these bothersome puzzles. I see. Thank you for your help. I've seen the way you look at him. It's better this way. Now then, do you mind if I ask you a few things, Iris? Fucking weirdos. <laughs> no, not at all. Why did you run? I'm sorry. I heard the inner temple had been severely shaken by that strong earthquake we had. I... I was so worried. I just had to come and see. In other words, you didn't run away to escape the law. At least we're clear on that. I can't tell you how relieved it was when I saw the sacred cavern was alright, but... I... But what? Then I saw all these chains in here. I saw all these extra locks that common that someone had put on the sacred caver cavern's door, and hmm. who in the world would do would do such a thing like this? <clears throat> these trick locks are a sacred treasure of the Korean tradition. There are hundreds of ways to set them. That's why only the person who set the lock can open it. And you're saying you aren't the one who set these locks? I don't think it's that simple, Miss Von Karma. When we were here the first time, there was only one lock. But now, there's five. What does that mean? It means that someone wanted to the security place even more. Oh, God. 
and they wanted to secure it before you got here, Iris. Probably so they could keep Maya inside. This means that Iris can only open one lock. What? Iris, please, is there any way around this? Mm, well, like I said, there are hundreds of different ways to set these locks. I suppose if I went through every combination with each one, I could remove them. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> but... No shit, Sherlock. <laughs> It will take an eternity, won't it? Yes, about a day if I had to guess. One day? That's not too bad. Well, it's better than leaving the locks in place. Will you do this for us? Sure. I'll do whatever I can. What's one more day? I'm sure Maya will be fine. You know what, Iris? There's still something I don't quite get. And what might that be, Phoenix Wright? I think it's obvious. Iris, on the night of the murder, where were you? Uh... Please, don't give me that look. You told us that you were in your room at the Hazakura Temple at the time. But you were also seen at the inner temple that evening. And then, you were spotted at the scene of the crime, in the temple as well. Fess up, you killed that bitch, didn't you? Being spotted at both Hazakura Temple and the inner temple, it's as if you were... <clears throat> well, Iris, I think it's about time you told us the truth. She's secretly a clone. There's something going on here that we don't know about. Mm. Shut up, bitch. <laughs> Wait, what? Huh? Wow. You sniffing? Harsh. <laughs> <laughs> The cops are still going through this place. They look pretty nervous. I'd be nervous too. It's probably tough to do this. Especially with someone staring me down the whole time. The fuck was that? Was that a dryer? It was a dryer. Yeah, it was a dryer. Uh, how could I have done that? Because you're weak! Wow. I can't believe it's still bothering them. Shame. Ah! Ah, oh, it's just you, baby. <laughs> uh, cringe! Wait, don't run. What do you want, right? What do I want? If you came here to laugh at me, then go ahead. <laughs> Go on, <laughs> laugh away. <laughs> well, I was ready to hug it out with him. But he's the same prideful Edward as always. You went back to the criminal affairs department, right? You said you wanted to look into something concerning Iris. Yeah, yeah, I did, right? Thanks to what I found, I was reminded of something terrible that happened. Was it your pride? You guys are putting a lot of effort into the investigation of the garden here, huh? There's a high chance it's the actual scene of the crime, right? That's why. You mean because of the writing in blood? And the talisman in the snow? As you know, those things couldn't have been planted here after the murder had happened, right? 
You're too smart for that, baby. Come on. But you don't really suspect Maya, do you? We have to treat everyone as a suspect. Maya, as well as Iris. It's the job, baby. You know what it is. I guess you still haven't gotten over your fear of earthquakes yet. No. Though thankfully, the nightmares have stopped. But still, if the ground gives the slightest tremor, I find myself short of breath. Seventeen years ago, when we were little school kids at the same elementary school, Edwards found himself in the middle of a murder. It all started with that big quake that hit the courthouse. Yeah, I was stuck in the elevator with my father. He was a defense attorney, like you. When we were deprived of oxygen, and we passed out, that's when it happened. That gunshot. The gunshot that shattered my whole life. I can still hear it. I lost everything that day, all because of that earthquake. Dreams, my family, and myself. It's been more than 17 years now. And that case was finally resolved two years ago, right? You think I don't know that? I was there. But it was such a shock. I could never have imagined I could be so wrong about myself and my life. But yes, I'm sorry. Right? Right? Nothing else I can say to you, baby. I'm truly sorry. Oh, shit. After you chose to become a lawyer for my sake. <sighs> And not after you saved me. That was when I gained everything back that I lost. Edward, you're stronger than you think. So stop pitying yourself. There was something that bothered me about her from the moment that we met. I felt like I'd seen her somewhere before. No, wait. Not somewhere. I felt like I'd seen her in court before. So you went back to the department to look for a file? Yes. I checked every case file I've ever worked on. I looked it over like I look over you. And I was right. With disgust? That's worth right. <laughs> I had seen her face before, six years ago. Six years ago? It was my first <laughs> appearance in court. And as cases go, it was my worst nightmare, right next to losing you, baby. So, who is she? It's alright. I can't give that information away to a member of the general public. But why not? It might be the crucial piece of the puzzle that solves this case. Not even for you, right? The woman I knew? the daughter of a jewelry store owner. It goes far above you. She had nothing to do with Iris and the Hazakura Temple. <clears throat> and neither did the case. No, that woman is completely unrelated to this murder. But that makes it sound like she's related to this murder. Yes, and I can say that with complete confidence. Would you die with that, Ashley, though? But Edward... That's not how this case goes. I need Edwards to understand this. I need to explain the connection between Iris and the woman that Edward knew. Yeah, we just leave. But I'm all out of text options. <laughs> dun dun. Wow. Yo, Tyler, I was gonna say, Tyler, you're slacking. <laughs> there you go. We hate. What do we pay you for? <laughs> you guys pay me? <laughs> yep. One twenty a year. You're telling me you're not part of the union? 
Go ahead, Rod, right, please. I'm finally getting to the bottom of this case. I can count on Iris to break these locks, so I should try to gather more clues. From Sister Bikini, Edward, Gumshoe, and Pearls. You beat me to it. It's weird that there's no one around all of a sudden. It gets quiet up here in the mountains when you're all on your own. I should check out the shack down this path. Maybe I'll find Harry there again. Uh, hello. Bro, look at hello. that ugly ass hello. font on that stuff. <laughs> Shit is painted on there, dog. Like, it's marked so Yeah, painted. I was gonna like, say, that shit look like it was it looked, fucking I, photoshopped been, on that I've bitch. I've been saying that for the longest time, and I fucking hate it. Like, it I is so bad. The dusk, you just saw the Dusky Bridge, the letters? Yeah, that's so yeah, bad. Yeah, I was like, what the Those fuck? Those Dusky Bridge letters are so fucking bad. I was like, they fucked anyway. up. Uh, Arturo? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mr. Nick! I've become more sophisticated! <laughs> I'm more sophisticated, <laughs> my language is now proper. What are you doing? My language is now proper. I said yes. yes. Nothing. What about Mystic Maya? Is she alright? We don't know that yet. Well, damn. You hate to see it. <laughs> 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 ah, what do you think you're doing here, Nick? Harry. Sorry. This is the loser shack where losers get together to lose themselves. And loser dumb? The what? I we fight fight comfort each other's tires, okay? You got a problem with that? <laughs> so Nick, Mr. Larice did a picture for me. Loser. Harry, I'm gonna need you to come down with me to the uh. Right. Yeah, just follow me to the precinct. We're going mm -hmm. to gather firewood now. We'll be cooking some half raw potatoes and we're visible little campfire. Ew. So get out of our way! Step away from the child, Harry. Don't believe a word I say anymore! Listen to me, pal! You don't... I want to trust this kind of guy, okay? He'll only let you down. Ah... Uh, you are pathetic, Larry. You are the most pathetic I've ever seen. Oh, that's dude. coming from me, a yeah. child! What can you tell me about this picture? I've got something to say to you, Nick! Thank even your real name. My life here now with Pearl. Two mm -hmm. losers cooking potatoes together forevermore. 911? <laughs> I have a slight emergency. And what Pearl, point you want... is this too much? Oh no. You want a brewski, Pearl? Alright, Pearls. You're the useful uh, one here. What can you tell me about this picture? I think, I think, it's been drawn really well. Is Granted, he is a loser. I can't draw at all, to be honest with you. I believe it's a certain skill that I need, that I can't attain. See? Someone appreciates it. It's tough getting the flames to like, <laughs> like that, you know? That sound effect? It's supposed you... to be Sister Iris flying through the air, isn't it? I love it. It's like a dream, a fantasy world. It's wonderful. No, 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 but not a dream. She <laughs> really flew, I'm telling you, Iris, because <gasps> that night. Impossible. <sighs> she used her telekinesis to fly through the air, man. That's all she did. <sighs> it's truly simple. Not you too, please don't look at me like that, bro. <laughs> Don't look at me like I'm some kind of new guy sipping you! Mm -hmm. 
I guess this picture really is a representation of what Harry thinks he saw. Okay, so I was half asleep when I was here at night. But I was wide awake after the lightning struck. And I saw what I saw, and it was exactly like I drew it in the picture. Flaming bridge with a flying flaming lady? Or was it? Hey, what's with that look of doubt in your face, hmm? <laughs> what? Huh? Yeah, you! I Paul? Pearls. Yes, Mr. Phoenix. Hey, you spotted him, huh? Mm -hmm. I've been meaning to ask you about the night as a murder. Ask away, sir. I'm Lieutenant Ward. Where were you? And what exactly were you doing when it all happened? I... I... I don't know. I was just... <laughs> I was just being a young, sophisticated kid. Minding my own business. I... I really... I, it doesn't matter what, what I was doing, Mr. Nick. In this case, Pearls, it does. I... On the night of the murder. You were supposed to be in Miss Dunham's room, reading the book together. Miss Denham's? Yeah, bruh. Oh, Nam. Oh, so what? Miss Dunham was murdered, and you, Pearls, were at the inner temple. What the fuck was that? Damn. God damn. Who trying to chat? What, what, what the hell was that, Phoenix? What was that? No, that was just my charger. Uh -huh. Just what happened tonight, Pearls? Fine. I will tell you. Oh, she's got like plus now. What? Zoran! I've been a very bad girl. Oh no! Please, don't make this weird. Don't make this weird. Please. No. We're gonna get demonetized. Uh, that's why I'm being punished. We are monetized. <laughs> yes. Oh, Adam, that was the funniest thing you could have said, honestly. <laughs> I, I was a bad girl. <laughs> what are you talking about, Pearls? My spiritual power. It disappeared. Her powers have disappeared. Impossible. What do you mean by that? It's... It's all over for me, Phoenix. A spiritual moon cannot channel the spirits any little more. Like as a painter who cannot paint. Did you just lose your arm? Hey! Hey! What are you looking at me for? Hmm? Pearls. Did you try to channel someone's spirit right here at Tazakura Temple? Tried, but failed to, perhaps. Damn it! <laughs> Damn. Oh, I'm not crying, damn it! What? Way, way to go, Nick! Better cry! That, that, that's really cruel! But she just said that she's not crying. Just as I thought. I'm going to have to break her Cyclops to get the truth out of her. Oh, beat her. What's with all these damn Cyclops? Oh my god. There are so many. It's my power, and I get to use it. <laughs> Throw that shit away. We don't need Throw this shit anymore. Shit away. We don't need it. Yeah, like a ring that can only sense minor movement. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, throw that shit away. <laughs> but that's my ultimate power. Minor movement. I wonder if Sister Bikini is back to the main hall yet. And I haven't seen Gumshoe around for a while either. Because I'm not here. Thank fucking <laughs> Maybe they're having a cup of tea together somewhere. Uh, Don't you're doing the investigation- or Gum, you're doing the investigation, Arturo. Oh, thank the fucking lord. Plopping. Hey, oh my I bet god. Gum, bikini type. Oh my god. But I think he prefers cops. He's been shaking this whole time? It's very cool. <laughs> <laughs> Well, what's the damage? Ah, oh, it's the sacred cavern! 
It's amazing. Somehow it grew more locks. <laughs> I wish my hair can grow more locks. And then I told Sister Bikini everything. Is that because you're bald? <laughs> what? <laughs> Set those tricks lockers or those of the Korean tradition. We have Iris at the Sacred Cavern, trying her best to open them for us right now. There's something I've been meaning to talk with you about, Sister Bikini. Oh yes, we were in the middle of a chat, weren't we? Yes, you were telling me how the Master of Korean disappeared 17 years ago. I need to know why Misty Face suddenly appeared at the temple. It was about a week ago when Mystic Elise, not Mystic Misty, arrived. Misty? And after she showed me that talisman, she proved that she was the master, she okay. said. Adams, the, uh, the victim is turned out to be uh, Maya's mom coming out of hiding. Because, you know, Maya has some fame in every game. Coming out of hiding? She was hiding? She wasn't dead? She was hiding she was for 17 disgraced. years. Yeah. She was disgraced after the case with Edgeworth. You don't remember um, that? Senior. Yeah. Man, I ain't gonna lie. I have not been paying attention to any of this shit that's she, happening. That shit We're like, in Maya that shit right now. Months ago. That shit's... She's lost. She, she's, we literally have a search and rescue party team for Maya. Oh, damn. This, okay, Arturo dude, would be this, proud. This was the first game. Arturo is proud. Well, at least a gumshoe Arturo mm -hmm. is proud. <laughs> okay, huh? look. Adams. Adams. Oh, wow. Ma Maya's mom. We figured out at the end of the first game that Maya's mom disappeared 15 years ago, now 17 years ago. And uh -huh. she, came, she came out of hiding for a very specific reason. We don't know what that to, reason is yet. To kill but somebody. She's dead. She's the one who's dead. How'd she kill somebody? Oh, shit. She tried to kill somebody and got clapped herself. Maybe Adam, not. Adam's crackhead theories aside. Let's continue. Hey, it might be Someone right. Someone is trying to destroy the Korean tradition's main family line. The Korean? We need to put a stop to them. <laughs> Someone's trying to destroy the Korean? Oh, <laughs> 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 God. The game got really... Someone's God. trying to destroy a religion. <laughs> Someone was trying to destroy the main family line. There's only one heir to the title of master at any time, and it's usually the eldest. That child becomes the new master of the Korean, and her daughters, the main family. All of the men become branch family members with no hope of controlling the clan. Anime bullshit. Clan? That's why no thing has changed throughout the history of the clan. Anime bullshit. Not the clan. Branch families have always and always will plot to erase those of the main family line. What is this? The uh, the uh, the uh, the what the fuck? Is, what's the Neji family line? Whatever the fuck. <laughs> Huga, 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 Huga. The Huga family? What the fuck is this? <laughs> the Huga. It's the Huga family, bro? What is this, bro? I said Huga like 10 times. Yeah, I said Huga. Yeah. Listen, we didn't it's listen Bakugan to you and because we don't respect right. you. Huga? Is the power of the master where is this much bloodshed? The Huga family clan, climb, bro. This is what happened right now. You believe in the technique, don't you, Mr. Rat? You know what? that the power is real. The technique of the man? Yes, I do. Specifically the right hand? Shut up. <laughs> it's been two years since I first met Maya. In that time, I've seen her channel with the spirits of the dead plenty of times. Not impressed. Hey, can't, you, can't, you, can't you only summon one spirit? The spirit oh. of one dead? You tell him she used to have multiple dead inside of her? No, no. there was another one. Remember Ooh. that case where she fucking stabbed the guy? What? Any meaning? What? That wasn't her. Oh, the, yeah, that, that wasn't her. She, she, didn't, yeah, she, did, she only, trans uh, only transformed into Mia. Ever. I forgot about That's that it. case. She only knows how to transform into her family. That's useless. That's ass. <laughs> that's, that's our, our troll would say that, come on. Of course. She, of course she's useless. During the last mass case and all that. Did she literally only come back just to eat some shit? What? 
Thanks, what? Maya. Wait, wait, wait. We just passed by that shit. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. We're not passing by this one. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck, What the fuck? We passed by the last one, but we're not passing by this one. Please explain that, man. What the fuck? <laughs> what I meant was, did she only come back in that one particular episode just to eat some food and dress up as a cosplay girl and then leave? No. Okay. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna say she with with Victor. <laughs> yeah, she, she, yeah, remember, my, Maya, Maya figured out how to channel Mia on cue and use oh, her. Oh, really? Yeah, she, she, yes. she, she, used, she used Mia as a means to seduce an old man and tell to make him tell shit. Like, literally, that's what happened. And Anthony oh, hates damn, him. damn, that's yeah. right. Man, you are forgetting every goddamn case. That wasn't I'm that bad. long ago, dog. Like, <laughs> to be honest, she if I'm not like actually having a lot, I don't pay that much attention. Did she just come Damn back man. just to eat shit? That was bad. I'm not It made a huge difference to the world, you know? Well, good, th good thing, Adams, you're gonna voice Apollo, you know? Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. I mean, the ability to commune with the dead? That's true psychic power, you know? Or necromancy. No, she's not bringing someone back to the Members of the tradition have always been there behind every important leader. Who I've definitely seen me touching some things too. before, but okay. Alright, bro. Did just stop talking? Like, you're all, right, bro. You're all to this progress. That, was like, much, that right? was like so out of context. I'm gonna need to hold off a little bit, Adams, alright? Good right, luck, she's 18, bro. bro. You still what? Oh, okay, go ahead. Lucky she's yeah. 18. I suppose so, but... With all that power and influence, I kind of expected you to be really rich by now. Are you saying we're poor, Mr. Wright? <laughs> you are a bitch-ass motherfucker, aren't you? Damn. And I'm People don't believe in it anymore. All because of one little mistake that some asshole made. A mistake? What was that? It was about 17 years ago, and eventually everything came crashing down. Like a meteor? Oh, but shut the fuck up, Adams, and I swear to God. <laughs> Damn, Adams, okay. you're, in the, you're in this game, bro? Uh, I don't know what I think she is. I'm sure the records still exist if you're interested. Locked up, of course. They wouldn't keep that out in the public. It was called the DL6 incident. You know, that thing from K from game one, that was a huge fucking deal. The DL6 incident? Right, nothing. Again. I know it well. Damn, someone I handled that in the case just two years ago. <laughs> Who the fuck snoring coke, bro? <laughs> Who the fuck was that? Did she sleep? Someone mentioned coke? Someone's- oh, yeah. Anyway, let's- let's- Yeah, that cocaine, bro. Who's oh, snoring that? La bro? cocaina! Ah, yeah, yeah. Tyler? It's someone's snoring? Tyler? No! No, I'm growling. no, it's me! No, Tyler's growling. Okay, anyway, let's move on. <laughs> oh! Oh. Ah, oh, that's right. So it was you who was the defense attorney on that case. A murder that took place 17 years ago. Beautiful. It was the first time in the country's history the police ever used a spirit medium. The idea was to channel the victim's spirit to learn the identity of in the medium that performed the channeling was Misty Faye, Maya's mother. Here, Misty Faye's channeling the name of a certain man surfaced. Armed with that as evidence, the investigators were spurred into action. But that man, he was found not guilty, wasn't he? Yeah, that's right, he was. And the case remained a mystery. That sounds yeah, like it was, they had a sh had a shitty ass defense attorney. In no, other no, words, no. They had a shitty ass defense attorney. Prosecutor, he was the I'm first sorry. Case in the world 
world I'd ever seen the Korean tradition openly involved in. It was all over the media, the public, the judiciary, the people of the Korean village. Everyone was like, man, this bitch ain't shit. Everyone said that she don't have the power. And then she just gave up, you know? She just gave up and didn't let show anybody. She demanded her children, fucking didn't do anything. But I know the truth. Missy Fay's spirit challenge wasn't a sham at all. Well, duh. And since you revealed the truth, we're finally making a comeback. We're no longer poor. And we're trying to fucking beat where people are we're franchising, man. But with a new master wielding the power of the clan being uh, Maya, you know, people don't like that. But Maya, why? Because it's Maya. Because yes, exactly. Listen, the spiritual power of the Korean channeling techniques, it's in the blood. Oh my god. Oh, the shot? I had so many exact same thing before. According to Maya, only the women in the family can inherit this power. The main family's bloodline stems directly from Mystic Amy. But with each new generation, only one daughter gets to become a new master. And the ones who don't become French families, right? They become that's trash. That's right, they get thrown in the garbage, and that's why they always try to do some bullshit. Damn, this really is the Hugo clan, huh? <laughs> <laughs> you know, Maya had a sister too, an older sister named Mia. Oh, yeah, 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 that, that, that haunted me. Wait, you know about her. Yeah, duh! She's like the hottest chick ever! Damn straight. She lost her life. Fairly recently. Do you know that Mystic, what she was rumored to have said before she died? It said, she said it wasn't only because of her mother that she became a lawyer. She also didn't want to fight with her sister over the leadership of the tradition. She was a real stand-up woman! Really a shame that she died and mocked me, my. It really should have been. It really should have been her. Huh? Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah exactly. Just call her trash. Listen, I don't need you to fucking talk to me. <laughs> anyway, when she saw what happened to her own mother, Mystic Misty, as she grew up, I guess Mystic Mia got tired of seeing all the rivalry between her mom and her aunt. You know that bitch with the thick hair. Back with the good hair. Big hair. God damn it! Fucking clean your ears. That's right, Misty Fay had an elder sister too. And Misty, having superior powers, managed to usurp the master seat from her. Misty Misty C sister, Mystic Morgan, as you probably know. Too many fucking Mystics, please stop. <laughs> right, the murder lady. It was just one year ago. <sighs> What she did was terrible. Also, she could make her own daughter the next master. Fucking Yuga clan bullshit. That's my baby. She really was. It really I suppose if you know about Mystic Morgan's daughter, then you must have already realized that Iris. What about Iris? She is, uh, she's Mystic Morgan's daughter. <laughs> yeah. What? Damn, so she ain't Dahlia in disguise. What does she mean by that? You're saying that Iris is Morgan Fay's daughter. Who? I thought you already knew that. It sounded like you met one of Misty Morgan's daughters already. I have. I know her very well. Oh. Yes, Pearl Fay. But I always assumed she was an only child. <laughs> you just that child. She's Mystic Morgan's. Uh, uh -oh. Niece. Well, I had no idea. Oh, she's a bastard child. Shut up, Adams. <laughs> 
Thanks, hey, man. I can't believe you were in this game, bro. Well, she's in prison now, right? She she can't hear what I'm saying, what I'm about to say? Yes, ever since she was found to be a co-conspirator in a murder case last year. It was all done to set Pearls up as the next master. Mystic Morgan had three daughters, not two, three. Wait, three daughters? Yeah, Iris, her twin sister, and then Mystic Pearl. Mm. By twin? Oh yeah, twins, you know, when like two people are born and they fucking look at it like exactly the same? What about fraternal? Shut up. <laughs> After the clan leadership was taken from her by her sister, Mystic Morgan's life crumbled. It wasn't many years later that she developed, you know, the, the Byakugan, and it got her really depressed and all that eyes, shit. Her eyes really look like the Byakugan right now, and I really hate that oh, y'all made that God. connection. <laughs> like, God damn it! <laughs> oh, that's what y'all see? I just see Raiden. With the hair and all that. Nah, bro. When Mystic Morgan's husband Real no talk. I'm t I'm yo, if Zavi, if Zavi were to draw veins on those eyes right now, that'd be Byakugan, like, off her. She's like, Byakugan. Like, <laughs> he left her in the village, taking the twin daughters with him, because he realized that she wasn't going to amount to shit. Man, does that mean when Maya transforms her eye, transforms into Mia, that means Mia's eyes is constantly white and veiny? No. Oh, yeah, that's, 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 right. that's 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 a specific Morgan thing. Don't worry about it. Go no, 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 no. I, I like when they use spiritual True, power. Shut up. I, I, white and veiny <laughs> every time. <laughs> spiritual power, white and veiny. Yeah. <laughs> New spirit every time. <laughs> it's fucking dumb. Just, go ahead, Rod. How awful. He was a jeweler, you know. He was, he was like, used to money. And then in the end, when he remarried, and that's when it happened, you know. He decided to give up one of his girls, you know. He said, you know what, I don't want to take care of two children. Two is too much for me. Take this one back. I don't like this one. She ain't a cold-hearted bitch like me. And that's what my mom always said. Damn, too. and it was Iris that did, that was giving up. <laughs> you hate to see it. It's unbelievable. If Iris had a twin sister, could it really be? Dahlia. Could you tell me one more thing, Sister Bikini? One more. What was the name of Iris' sister? Uh, I don't. I'm sorry, man. I don't know. I don't really give a shit about their family. I only know every fucking detail about them. Well, that's a clue, I guess. A jeweler. Thank you very much. You've helped clear up a lot of details. Pearls had two older sisters, huh? Yeah, that's right. No doubt it was all because Mystic Morgan's anger toward the main family. Anger? What do you mean? Damn, she's an edgy if Nikki didn't change. She was taken from her by her bitch of a husband. But even that couldn't destroy her dream that a child of hers would one day lead the clan. And that's why she had pearls. It seems that the incident here was a result of Mystic Morgan's anger. He was able to break free of the bars that confined her. If Iris has a twin sister, the plot only gets thicker from here. But this information will be useless unless I can flesh it out a bit. I need more info. It's, gu it's gumshoe time, Arturo. Not the Neji's oh, dead. Oh, Shut up! No spoilers! Elias <laughs> scamming her is. jeweler father, huh? Sounds like someone's happy. What tune is that they're humming? I'll be right back. The wheels in a bus go round and round. One of them. Sing it. Oh, sing it? Hold on, I gotta... Alright, alright, I got this, I got this. 
It's scary. It's Friday. Diamond on me dancing just like lightning. Like lightning. Pull up on your bitch. He got excited. Excited. <laughs> oh shit. Oh yeah. They biting. Oh. I love this song. <laughs> I don't give a fuck about clues anymore. Man, fuck my job, bro. It's not what investigating is all about, though. Investigating, investigating, loves investigating. It's investigating, you know? Investigating. Because it'd be scary and frightening. And then diamonds on me dancing just like lightning. Pull up on your bitch. He got excited. Excited. Come on, he was doing reggae. Reggae? <laughs> Go see the one, Rob. That was reggae? I'm very confused. What the fuck? But all right. Every case is gonna be airtight. Every Third case thing, is gonna be airtight. Hey. What's goody? Oh, me? Yeah, you. How long you been there, bruh? <laughs> I just got here. Alright, bitch. So what are you up to, detective? I'm just doing shit. <laughs> I made a promise to Mr. Edgewood, you know? I promised that I'll find, like, the real murder weapon, cuz. 